Hey crafty friends, today I want to share with you a, how to create a folder. This is part of a new series that I'm sharing, the Ultimate Tri Folder Suitcase Mini Album. So let's get started. We need a 12 by 12 black cardstock and we are going to mark it on the 4 inch line and on the 8 inch line. Always mark two points, that would give you a straight line. And then simply draw two vertical lines where you marked on the 4 inch line and the 8 inch line. The next step is to simply turn the page and now we are going to mark it on the 3 inch line and the 9 inch line and do the same. Draw two vertical lines. So I just want to share with you that the Trifold Suitcase Mini Album Series uh, will teach you how to create an amazing interactive suitcase shape mini album with three different interactive folders in it. Each folder is completely different. This is the first folder out of the three and I want to share with you how to make it. And of course if you want to see how to create the entire mini album you need to join the VIP room and you'll have a link at the end of the video. So now we have the basic shape of our folder and we need to cut out the four corners, the four squares in the corners in order to create the final shape of our folder. So I always recommend using a craft knife and a ruler that will give you really nice cuts and make sure not to cut all the way through and remove only the squares in the corner just like that. So I'm removing the corners and that would give me sort of a cross shape and that will be our folder. Now basically a folder is sort of a mini album within a mini album so they're really fun to make and in the series we'll ma be making three different folders with lots of pockets, flaps, envelopes and other interactive mechanisms that you don't want to miss. So this is our folder and now we need to create the closing mechanism. Now the first score that you need to make is on the vertical line that you can see marked with the pencil and basically we need to make three score lines um, one eighth of an inch apart so we will have an option to insert more things more mechanisms inside the folder and close it very easily these these score lines basically um, increase the size of our fold so if you would to make just one fold then you wouldn't have enough uh, room to insert mechanisms inside the folder and then close it properly. But this is the mechanism you need to create in order to do that because that will sort of um, create a bulkier closure. And you do the same thing on the sides as well. You start by scoring the line that is marked with a pencil and then you take one eighth of an inch to the right or left depending on the side and then another one eighth of an inch and then you should have three score lines on each side of your folder. So this is basically how the folder looks when it's ready and now it's time to create the inserts. So you need three squares five and seven eighth of an inch by three and seven eighth of an inch and we score the first one on the three quarter line the second one on the one and a quarter line and the third one on the one and three quarter line and then we simply fold and this will give us once we bind them together with a stapler this will give us sort of a six flap insert like this. You simply put them all together and then you get sort of a little booklet that this will be our insert. This is the base 
to build all the pockets, flaps, belly belts, envelopes, etc. So this is how it looks. I like to do it with a staple because it's strong and fast. And I also like to go over the staple the little staple pins with a black marker so they won't be so visible. And this is basically the first folder. You put the glue on the back of your little six flap booklet and simply glue it in the center of the folder. And if you want to see the rest of the series and how I created the entire mini album, you can join the VIP room at anatkessler.com and then see all the goodies and all the mechanisms and inserts that I created in this mini album. So you have the link under the video and I hope to see you there. <laughs>